All right. So now you might be wondering, okay, what is this fancy piece of software you are using to record this? So you see, I have my little arrow spot. Um, you see me, this is one thing, I don't know why it always is open like this, but hiding this, I can make myself big as I was in the intro video and then take you over my shoulder, make you small. And yes, you can actually have all, all of these features for free. I am using something called Loom. I do, again, have a paid version of this software, but there are lots of options with the free plan. So this is what it's called, um, loom.com. These are the different plans. So the starter plan free, up to 100 videos and screenshots, that's plenty um, if you're just doing one online course. Um, and as you can see, this $8 a month billed annually or $10 monthly, really minimal if you do want the paid plan. Um, you can do custom branding and all sorts of things in there. Um, you also get this 14 day free trial if you'd like. Um, and, uh, and yeah, so this is really a great tool. It has all of these features. Um, as you can see, it did record that PowerPoint video if you watched that portion prior. So it records both your, um, in your browser options and here, um, you'll see this is what it is recording up here. This little spike. And what happens is it creates a nice little account for you. Wait for myself to load, make sure it's still showing. Here we go. So here um, it gives you folders, online courses, instructions for my team. So this is a nice way if you do have a team um, and you wanna be able to share video instructions, keep those in here. It's also, I use it with clients all the time. I show them how to do things with these little videos. But um, as you can see, this is just a great tool. Um, you can record both the screen and yourself. You can also elect either to just record the screen or just record yourself, the camera. Um, so you have all of those options. A few other things to note, um, you might see here, I do have a professional microphone. I actually got this because I have a podcast, not because of my online coursework. Um, any sort of headset, um, is recommended. Your computer microphone will do, but the quality won't be as great. So it's recommended to like, if you have a, a Mac computer, you can use your Apple headphones um, or any sort of headset with a microphone. Or if you do have the professional, um, more of a real deal stand-up mic like I have, then that works too. Um, other things to take note of are camera positioning. So I actually have my laptop that I'm recording with propped up at an angle. So it's looking down at me. Um, and I have a light ring over here sorry, over here and a window over here. So I have good lighting. So there's other things you want to pay attention to. You don't need a light ring. You could just be in front of a window. Um, but those are things just to pay attention to when you are recording to make sure you have some decent quality. Um, but yeah, Loom can't recommend it enough. That is the secret magic sauce to how you're going to record your online course. So enjoy. And we'll get into once you record it, um, how you can sort of make sure that it's edited correctly and put together well, and then how we're gonna post it to an online course platform in your WordPress or Squarespace six. Remember, no additional software here. So thanks, and we'll be back in touch.